Hope everyone's having a great day. Done with my workout. And I was working on a topic yesterday. If you needed an appendectomy or broken arm, you'd go to the doctor, you'd seek help. But why is it 40% of men won't talk about or seek help for their mental health? Now, seeing as how 75% of all suicides are men, this is kind of an important issue. Here's the deal, guys. There's no shame in getting support or help. And again, this is why having a community of high quality men like we have in Mentoring Men can make such a big impact because sometimes it's what, you too? Or we get to have deeper conversations. We also talk about techniques managing this. Again, we're not therapists, we're not claiming to be, but a coach can do quite a lot sometimes to help you figure it out or know when to get help. So here's the deal. Keep in mind, 80% of counselors suck. Therein lies part of the problem. But when asked why the men won't speak about it, they reported they didn't want to be a burden. They're embarrassed. There's a negative stigma associated with it. And they had no one to talk to. And again, this is where community brotherhood comes in. But 40% won't talk about it, but 77% of men said they suffer from anxiety, stress, or depression. And, kind of like a skin cancer, it doesn't go away if you ignore it. And dealing with it and learning how to regulate things, learning how to properly look at how to handle your emotions, look at your thoughts that become emotions and not give them credence. Look at, again, embrace the emotion. I'm not saying ignore your emotions. Embrace it, but then let it go. What happens is we hang on to these things sometimes for too long. and We give them energy, we give them life. And that is a problem. So, if you've been struggling and you feel you're in a dark place, reach out to someone, please. Do it for yourself, do it for your family. I didn't know until I was doing this prep, I guess November's Mental Health Month, was totally unaware of that. I just had this idea pop into my head based on a couple of conversations and some things. So. Treat your mental health just like you would your physical health. You go to the gym, you take care of yourself, you need to also take care of your mental health because you're worth it, all right? So find a counselor, there's inexpensive ways to get help if you don't have coverage with your benefits at work. Find a friend that you can have a deep conversation with, do some research, reach out. All right, brother? Have a great week.